What is going on guys? It is Fatal Reaper Day bringing you guys a video. We are here on the HP Pavilion. Actually, we are screen recording on my main PC so I can show you guys uh, more to the point of what to do and help with FPS loss. So that being said, um, in you know most ga some games are on the HP Pavilion to be exact. Be sure to hit the like and subscribe button as always, guys. So to be exact, sometimes you will get FPS drops. So it happens in uh, PCs, uh, laptops, anything. It can even happen in consoles where you can have issues, run into lag, whatnot. So there are a few things that you can do to fix that FPS drop. For instance, now we're not on my uh, the laptop here, so I can't exactly show you. The battery settings but right here where you normally see the battery you're gonna go ahead and click that on high performance make sure your battery is set to high performance all right second thing to possibly fix FPS drops and stuff like that is your drivers biggest thing here is you want to check go to your home this is your GeForce experience make sure you download GeForce experience all you got to do is go to Google Chrome type in GeForce experience it will pull up it will be a program it will download you will also have a recording software called shadow play with that but in also in that you will have drivers and you will be able to check for updates. As you can see, all the drivers are up to date on my main PC here, but they are also up to date on my laptop. So the same rules will apply. It will say if your drivers are not up to date, and if you do have a download, do be sure to download those drivers and then express the installation. This installation uh, process will take roughly maybe hmm, five to 10 minutes to giving on your internet and other factors. That being said, once that is finished, make sure you restart your PC. It's good to restart it, restart the laptop. Then whatever game you're playing, you can jump back on and you should have no issues as far as FPS drops go. Again, there can be many things due to FPS or causing FPS drops. It just kind of depends, but this is one of the bigger ones. There is two Windows settings. So you just go down here in Windows in the uh, left corner here. You'll type in settings uh, and you'll go to your update and security and make sure you update any Windows settings you might have it will also trigger a restart of your PC as well that being said that's pretty much it for the update kind of aspect of it and of course put make sure your battery performance is on high and if you don't play on the charger do make sure your charger is plugged in that will gives you the max performance for the laptop alright so now I'm gonna show you on the laptop one game in particular I'm gonna put Fortnite I'm gonna use Fortnite as a good indication and good um, kind of uh, basically as far as settings go in certain games that you can to stop FPS drop and stuff like that so we're gonna turn here to Fortnite here in just a moment uh, and show you guys exactly the settings that you can do that will also help prevent FPS drop and it will go for pretty much any game you play like that and everything like that so alright guys in this portion of the video we're gonna be using Fortnite as the game I'm gonna be showing you guys everything as far as settings go for the FPS drop so first of all you're gonna to wanna to go to settings you wanna to go to of course your graphics settings and you wanna make sure that you have the uh, go down to advanced graphics make sure that performance mode is set on so it's gonna be the last one the third one to be exact it's performance mode and this is the best settings to use for Fortnite on this and this goes for any game that you're playing uh, I do put low textures and low meshes on as well and I do actually cap the FPS at 120 instead of unlimited that is another way where your FPS won't drop go down or up it typically stays at a constant 120 you can of course cap it to different ones that you like um, so that's the that's the key for most games too so if you'll set your settings down on towards low medium settings and or performance mode if they have one like Fortnite that is your better typical uh, input where you want to put your settings where you'll get less FPS drops and stuff like that. Also, another uh, one to note, do make sure that all programs are completely closed down. Make sure Steam's not running and downloading games. Make sure uh, even Chrome is not. Make sure none of those back uh, you know background apps or applications or anything like that is running. That way you have nothing but the entire, um, basically everything is putting the power to run whatever game you're playing. Also, another thing you can do, if you uh, push Control alt delete and open up your Task Manager, you can right-click on the game, and you can put uh, Select Performance, or is it, uh, oh yeah, excuse me, Highest Priority. So if you make it the highest priority, the system will automatically run the game or application to its highest priority, where it will also make sure that everything is run and all the power, in a, essentially, is put to running that application. There, um... That being said, that's pretty much most of the stuff that you can do, the common things that you can do for the FPS 
any kind of FPS drops or anything like that and fix like that. You can also just do a complete restart of your computer. That may may help. Or uninstall the game as well. Uninstall and reinstall a game may help with those fixes as well. On top of um, maybe even... Uh, so make sure your games are updated too. So it makes your Fortnite or Modern Warfare, whatever you're playing, has no updates. Uh, something for Modern Warfare, I might add. Make sure that the shaders do, in fact, go to 100% before you start playing. That can also knock down your FPS and cause FPS drops. That being said, I'm pretty much, I'm pretty sure I covered pretty much everything as far as the basis goes of FPS drops. If you guys have any more questions or having anything else happen that none of these are fixing, do let me some, uh, leave me some comments down below. I'll try my best to help you out and jump into anything like that. One last thing I will add for lag. Now, this is for lag. Now, sometimes, though, when you're lagging and your internet connection can cause you to also, on the side of that, uh, FPS drop. So if you're running into that, you can also make sure you, if you have access to it, plug your laptop into an Ethernet cord. So use an Ethernet cord and go directly to your router, and you should have a complete more stable connection, where until you'll run into no connection issues with that, which in return can drop your FPS if you're having a bunch of issues, much of lag. So that is another uh, plus right there. Um, so that pretty much sums up the FPS drop fix. Again, if you guys have any questions, leave me some comments down below. Um, I'll be sure to get back to you as quickly as possible, try to help you out, you know, uh, if I can try to find the fix for it. I've had a lot of FPS drops and stuff like that on my main computer and the P uh, laptop as well, and I've been able to pretty much fix those uh, in turn for that. So, that being said, guys, make sure your drivers are up to date, make sure you play on charger, battery performance is on high, that kind of stuff that will typically keep your... Oh, one last thing. So, I know it's kind of ironic, I'm recording in this video... But, do make sure that you're not recording or anything like that. Make sure all streaming, uh, I mean, unless you're wanting to stream, of course, but make sure uh, you're, if, you're wanting to, if you're wondering why your FPS is dropped, recording can drop your FPS as well. So, make sure if you're not needing to record, turn off highlights as well. So, in settings and Fortnite, make sure you go over to the, it should be in the settings, HUD bar, or the last branch of settings, do make sure that highlights, NVIDIA highlights, if you guys have NVIDIA and use GeForce, make sure those are turned off. That will in turn also give you a uh, better, you'll run into less FPS drops and less, of course, malfunctions or anything like that. Again, guys, be sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.